Tonight, there's mounting frustration among police, city leaders, and residents over the recent shootings in an apartment complex in Newport News. Four shootings in just five weeks, and so far, not many answers. The latest shooting happened yesterday, right across the street from the police station. Chopper 10 was above the crime scene on Dresden Drive off of Jefferson Avenue. In this case, the victim is expected to survive, but investigators say he's not giving them much information. To on your side's Matt Gregory just got back from Newport News with more on how to stop the violence. Matt? Yep. The police need the public's help to solve the shootings in Newport News, and as police investigate this latest shooting, they're saying they're having a tough time getting cooperation from the people who actually live there. Newport News police told me the 22-year-old shot yesterday has not cooperated with investigators. And to make matters worse, even though the shooting happened in broad daylight, police haven't had many witnesses. The same story goes for the last two shootings on Dresden Drive. Not enough witnesses coming forward and cooperation from surviving victims is minimal. Police say the interesting part is the reasons the victims give for not wanting to help in their own investigation. This victim is probably going to survive and he's got to know something. But he decides he don't want to say anything. And we, we get that from time to time now. It used to be a lot worse problem. I mean, we had, had, we had had victims say things like, you're the police, you figure it out. Or I, my friends and I take care of it when I get out of the hospital. Newport News Police told me they want to emphasize that they want people to use the crime line. That's 1-888-LOCK-YOU-UP. They say that is the anonymous way to give tips that could be key, especially in this investigation. In the newsroom, Matt Gregory, 10 on your side.